everybody. I just want to say hello. And it's going to be a little unboxing video. I want to apologize uh, for not uploading in I think almost two months. I have to like, check when my last date was. Um, I've been, my health has been like really suffering. Uh, work has been really putting me through the paces. Uh, the good news is I saw a doctor today and she was really awesome. She's my new family doctor and uh, we're gonna start figuring out what everything is. And I got a month leave so um, hopefully I'll be able to resume videos. Hopefully maybe at least once every two weeks maybe I'll try again to resume weeklies but um, I'll go more into it. I hope to do a vlog video next week because I really want to show you guys where I live, the marsh that I call home which is gorgeous and I can blab about stuff. But um, this is a parcel from Sarah and and uh, it's from a swap I did back in April and sadly the first one got lost in the mail and she was really kind enough to make me another one and I really really appreciate that and I'm super excited. This thing weighs a ton and like it's super gorgeous and I don't want to show the front but she has these little notes written on it maybe a little carried away with the tape and in the front is happy mail crossed off and says messy. Um, I love it and the little notes are so adorable. See if I can get everything out. There's so much in here. Oh, ah, this is geek fuel. Ah, oh my gosh, where did you find that? That's amazing. I am a huge geek. Huge, huge geek. Turtles. Oh my gosh. So yeah, I love this. And I'm saving everybody's envelopes. And I think I'm going to make um, a little junk journal out of all my swapping. Oh wow, it's like a whole pin. And it's my favorite Ninja Turtle! When I was a kid, Donatello... is it? it looks, yes, it is Donatello. Donatello was my favorite, because he was like the cool guy. He was just cool as a cucumber. And yeah. Oh my god, that's so cool! He actually got my favorite turtle. Haha! -ha. <laughs> okay. Alright, and I have to remember, I'm upside down to everybody. And I don't know, there's a note? Oh my god, it's just so full of stuff. A oh, little envelope with the, I love this washi. I don't want to break everything. I don't know if you without harming it. I love this like stained and aged paper. Oh, oh there's little confetti flowers. Ooh, these are gonna be fun for inches. I started making inches. That's also why like the only art I've been doing is uh, honoring swaps that I participated in and I didn't want to film it because I wanted it to be a surprise. So yes, I will be sending out torn tags which um, they're swaps from Sugar's Candies but inspired by... oh, I don't care... Dawn. Let's make a mess today. I'll leave a link to her channel. And uh, we've been doing a lot of Dawn inspired swaps. And um, has Dawn Darwin? Blame Dawn Darwin. <laughs> Hashtag. Cause she comes up with these really funky ideas to do like really fun, junky projects and using up scraps and stuff. And uh, yeah, so we've all kind of jumped on her bandwagon. I think she also started a Facebook group too. So I'll try to track that down. I, I believe I'm a member. And I'll put that in the description. So yeah, I've been making inches. So these little flowers are so pretty. And all these little cutouts. Oh, there's a, a butterfly. Enjoy life in an owl. Oh my gosh. Where do you guys find this? I guess, yeah, I don't get out to the craft store <laughs> as much as I need to. And all these little cute wood cutouts. And these will be great for... Decorating covers. More flowers and these little... Oh, cool. This is very cool. And I really love how this paper is stained. I'm wondering what technique you used. Oh, there's more. There's little, like... Um, like your, my brain is completely fried. Part of my illness is I can't remember things or vocabulate. Or... It's like my ADHD has gone through the roof. All right. Super cute! All oh, the flower confetti. I love the owl. He's so pretty. Hehe. <laughs> now this is a book. 
Is it a sticker book or an activity book? Oh my gosh, there's just so full of things. Is that a photograph? Ooh, are you into photography too? Okay. <laughs> it, is it? Oh, Shopkins. Okay, that's why. <laughs> I'm like, these look familiar. <laughs> <laughs> and I couldn't figure out why my my stepdaughter a couple years ago was like super huge into Shopkins. She has so many, so it's really cute when I see uh, the girls and Liz getting the Shopkins and the little grab bags. I got myself with my little pony grab bag, but I got three dollars this tiny little pony, and I hunt down vintage ponies at the thrift store and I get them for a dollar or two. So I, I thought the value was a little kind of. Off. I'd rather rescue uh, the poor ponies from uh, from my childhood. I don't have many, but I, maybe I have like a dozen. Two survived my childhood, sort of. One got, well, a lot of them got chewed by my dog. So one survived without chew marks, the other one kind of survived. Oh no, three survived. One had its head broken, which I fixed. One got chewed, like it's got chew marks, but the pony is intact, and the other one is unscathed. <laughs> <laughs> Those were the only three, and I had dozens of them. So this is super cute. I really like the the patterns. I don't know if she, she's... My, my stepdaughter's growing up so fast, so I don't know if she's still into the Shopkins. I think uh, she's replaced all her little miniature figurines. She had lots of them. Nom noms, or like there's little cupcake perfiteral things. Tons, tons and tons. And littlest pet shop, tons. She, she must have hundreds of little doodads. Oh, it's Eeyore. Oh, the bees. I love the bees. House. I have to keep my eye open for stuff like this. Is that an apple blossom? No, uh, I don't know. Photograph DDLC. Ooh. I really like photography. You make me smile and laugh. And all of you girls on the group do, and I cherish it. Oh, this is funky. I like that. All kinds of... <gasps> Futurama! So, I like this. I like funky stuff. But I'm like a huge Futurama fan. <laughs> What's a postcard? Beast with a million backs. Very cool. My roommate's gonna get a kick, and my boyfriend gonna get. We're all like Futurama fans. Uh, my roommate and I have been playing Game of Drones on on uh, on the phone. Aww. <laughs> I have a thing with textured paint so bad, and it's it's a crazy story. Uh, when I was in elementary school, I was maybe in grade three or grade four. Somebody donated a painting to the school, like a beautiful landscape. And uh, they had it up on an easel, and uh, we had an assembly at like the end of year. Oh, you got thanks? How are they? I'm so curious about them. So curious. Um. Uh, and uh, yeah. Anyways, after the assembly, like I went up to look at the painting, and it had all this lovely texture. And I reached out to gently touch it, and it was an oil painting, and it was still wet. And I was mortified. I just turned around and ran away. I didn't tell anybody. This is like the first time I've told a soul. <laughs> oh no, I might have told my boyfriend the story. Um, oh, cool. It's so cute. And there's like kanji on the back. I don't know which 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 uh, which language, but I love crazy characters. Well, not crazy. There's somebody's alphabet, but I like alphabet different from our own. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, it's a pipe! I'm like, what is it? It's a pipe. Like, like a Sherlock Holmesy pipe. Very cool. Minions. Haha, <laughs> minion cards. <laughs> My roommate. She likes Futurama and she freaking loves minions. Very, very cool. Hehehe. <laughs> Okay, I know they're a band, but I'm not sure who they are. I'm gonna have to look it up. My boyfriend will probably know. He's a bit older than I am. Is it the monkeys. Very cool. 
there'll be white blackbirds before an unwilling woman ties the knot. Show the fatal, fatted calf, but not the thing that fatted him. The old pipe, <laughs> the old pipe, well, I can't read upside down. The old pipe gives the sweetest smoke. I really like these. Marriages are all happy. It's having breakfast together that causes the trouble. <laughs> I like that. The length of a conversation, don't tell nothing about the size of the intellect. Well, I love these. When you're putting together an outfit, take your time. Wait for all the loose-lipped, manicured cowboys to run their line and wander off. Then make your picks from the wise heads who stayed around listening and thinking. That's really cool. Another cute card. Oh, so cute. And Shopkins. <laughs> these are really fun. Like, where are all these fun playing cards go? That's cool. I remember I traded... I think I had gotten the funky playing cards, uh, and I traded a couple in each uh, each packet that I made. Okay, so I oh, it's red right on the other side. <laughs> I love it. Oh, I'm such a huge geek. Like like did role playing games in Dungeons and Dragons the whole nine yards when I was in college. Huge huge geek. It's a ship. Me. <laughs> That's so cute. So, so cute. Hello, peace of mind. Oh, cool. That's neat. It's like a little gift. <laughs> okay, this is a little gift. This from a gift box from uh, a beauty box from Target, which we don't have that up here. But this... It's amazing. It's a flip-flop. It's a party invitation. <laughs> you know, uh, would this fit? I'm going to be making a flamingo, um, I think it was Colleen sent me a bunch of flamingo stuff. I'm going to be making a, like a decorated junk journal, but you know, one of the pretty ones. Not like a junky junk journal, uh, with flamingo stuff. And this would like fit right in somehow. It's going to be a small book, so maybe I have to fold it in half. I don't know. I'll figure out something, but this is amazeballs. Okay, the little color swatch. I like the lines, actually, and the texture. <laughs> Mold prevention. These are funky. I'm actually a homeowner, so this is kind of fun. Electrical wire. See, this is all the stuff my boyfriend knows, and I just, I do the cooking and the, that kind of stuff, and he does the building, because I am inept with power tools, but this is very cool. Oh, cool. Oh, this would be neat. These are some, like, I love floor plans and blueprints, and there was tons and tons and tons at work, like, old ones, like, drawn by hand in the uh, abandoned building, and... I wanted to take them so bad, but, you know, that would be stealing, but they were so cool. I guess I should have, like, just asked my boss if I could have them, so they're getting thrown out. But, yeah, like, old blueprints from, I don't know, 50s, 60s, like, on, like, nice aged paper. This is too cool. You got trees and stuff. Oh, this is so cool. I don't know, I like plans, maps, all that kind of stuff. This is a furnace, maybe? Pamphlet about a furnace? Gas furnace! Cool! This is like really nice and shiny and soft. Well, not soft, it's smooth. I have an old oil furnace in my basement that I need to get rid of. And I want to put a wood furnace. Because we heat by wood. Cool. Got a little program or an advert for a show. All rainbows. This would oh, so much cool stuff. This too would go with like the color scheme of my flamingos. Oh, these are so cute. I've started to find napkins finally. I know like every unboxing, I'm like, where do you get these cool napkins? I've started. So I'll have some napkins to trade for my next swaps. So pretty. Cause yeah, you get you buy like a pack of napkins, and there's like. 
at least a dozen in there, so I don't need a dozen of the same napkins. I'll gladly share. Oh, so pretty. So yeah, I got a good napkin stash going. Thank you so much, Sarah Ann, for like being patient and just sending out a new one. Ah, lobsters! <laughs> I am I know I'm amused by the silliest things. And I'm sorry I'm low energy. I just came back from the doctor. But this is awesome. Lobsters! I love it. I absolutely love it. I think I, I think one of the, I got sunflowers recently. Yeah, I'll go. Well, okay. I, there's a couple more, but to put away. These are the ones that were just on top. I don't know if you can see it. These ones are like little blackbirds. So I'll have some of these to share, and then just some pretty flowers. I think I got one set with uh, Volkswagen Beetle hands on it, because I'm obsessed with them. This retro-y, kind of splotchy print, I love it. And the little jelly beans, or little candy eggs, they're so pretty. So, so pretty. Thank you. And some text paper. Is very cool, nice for making tags and stuff. Oh my gosh, there's just so much stuff. Is that? Oh, I see something geeky, I want to go look at it. Bad hair! <laughs> is that what the, um, is it not a band, but like some pages from the bad hair book? Let's see, where'd it go? Oh no, well, he has good hair. But it could have been the bad hair book. So maybe they're not a band. <laughs> Just some old hairstyles, which I think is cool. I like, personally, men with long hair. That's just me. But I grew up, my daddy always had long hair. And still does. So for me, it's just natural. The geek paper is amazing. Ooh. Some kid book. A lovely illustration. I've got some others that I got from other people. Some more geekery. Did you go to a Comic Con? Maybe? Geek Fuel exclusive. Oh, it's a thing. Well, maybe it's like a. I'll have to look up what Geek Fuel is. Is it like a subscription box? Someday I'll have money for this stuff. But very cool. Okay, yeah, I guess it's a subscription box, maybe. Or magazine? I'll have to look it up. But it was very fun, and thank you for the geekiness. Little Deadpools. I have some friends that are like way into Deadpool. I haven't seen the movie yet. <laughs> Which a lot of people are swatting at me. Um, but I'm waiting for uh, when I have surgery, I'll watch all this stuff. Now, this looks very Zelda ish. Which Zelda, like, I grew up playing video games. So part of my geekery is video games. So that's very cool. Hidden Staircase. I'll have to look all this up, but thank you for giving me the cool packaging. Geeky, geeky packaging. Aww. I really like this. <laughs> and all the people in costumes. <laughs> very, very cool. <clears throat> so much thank you. You spoiled me rotten. World of Warcraft. I played World of Warcraft a bit. Like I said, huge geek. Okay, so it's okay. This is from Loot Crate. So, Harlequin! It's really cool. Uh, when I was thrifting back, I think in May, I found a whole bunch of X-Men comics, which I got, and they're about a buck each. I was really happy with that. And I went to a convention, and there was like a garage sale table in the, the, the dealer's room. And I got a whole bunch of Gargoyle comic books, which Gargoyles was like my favorite cartoon when I was a kid. Very cool. Ooh, I like this. I like fashion photography a lot. But I really want to do some a photo, a photo project with casting shadows. But I guess it's shadows of jewelry, but I really like that. Yep. I really like fashion photography. But I am going into that direction. I'm going to be doing photo shoots, portrait photo shoots for, um, for regular women, so like kind of vanity style 
Vanity Fair style, magazine style um, portrait sessions for, for women in my area. So I'm going to be starting my business, hopefully. Portland Sunday Market. That's a huge market. Awesome. Is that a... Um, Oh, cool! It's a tourism. I love tourism books. I did. I loved it when I was a kid, <laughs> and I would read them. But you know, I'd find local ones, and I no most. Ooh, that's a pretty picture. I really like that. I can make a tag out of that. Um. So yeah, I'm gonna have fun geeking out and all the, all about Portland. I think it's this one. Is it tourism or is it just adverts for local business? Ooh. So I, I work a lot, I volunteered uh, with Montreal Etsy team, which is a, a, a group of artisans from Montreal, which is the big city in my province, um, and I volunteered uh, quite a bit with them for I think about a year, year and a half before I got ill. Uh, so yeah, I, I really like seeing artisanal work and artwork by locals, so this is going to be fun. Yay! Ooh, the fish. Thank you. I love learning about where everybody is. Oh, I like this. I am obsessed with unicorns. Oh, thank you. That's so pretty. It's from a magazine from the 80s. Very cool. <laughs> Thank you. I really love that. That's so pretty. And rainbow banana peel. Oh, more geek fuel. Oh, and more unicorns. Oh, okay. One thing at a time. I'm getting all hyper. <laughs> Very cool. Geekery. And it's, I've been looking for geeky stuff, like video game stuff, because I have in my travel journal, or maybe that's where you got your inspiration to send me geeky stuff. Um, we went to... Ah! Labyrinth! And Cactuar! Okay. The geek is strong. Zoltar! When I went to Pittsburgh, we saw a Zoltar in one of the truck stops. So yes, we went to Pittsburgh for a video game convention, because my boyfriend's business is making... remaking retro video games. So he did Donkey Kong and Donkey Kong Jr., and he has another project in his line of sight, which I shall not divulge. Top secret. Um, so yeah, video games are a big part of our life, and I was having a hard time finding, like, you know, old school video gaming stuff to put in my journal. So, I might find some stroof in here. I saw a piranha plant, <laughs> puppet, which is cute, and Pac-Man. I can't believe this is old tire. I, I can put him in my travel journal because we, well, I have a picture that I, I took with me beside this old tire, so that can be a page. Awesome this. Thank you. This is gonna be this is like so much great stuff. Oh, uh, and oh did I mention when I was obsessed with unicorns in another video? <gasps> There's so I must have or said it on, on the group because you just spoiled me with unicorn goodness. Like I wanna frame these and put them on my wall. <laughs> oh my gosh, you just, oh, that's gorgeous. Oh, they're so pretty. They're so, so pretty. Oh, okay, I like this. This is really, this, I love. Oh, the pursuit of the, oh, oh, darn, I hate it when there's like, both sides are amazing. Oh, Thank you so much. <gasps> it's like saving the best for last. It was on the bottom. They are amazing. And I love silver. Oh no, these... Okay, this is like hoarding alert big time. Oh, okay, I didn't even see the side. <sighs> and the watercolor. I guess it was just a book on unicorns? Oh, like, I remember doing, um, in art history in college, we studied a bunch of stuff, and we studied the, the uh, Hunt of the Unicorn Tapestries, and I think I actually wrote a paper for my humani humanities class on them, because I was, always been obsessed with unicorns. 
and like the movie Labyrinth was uh, not Labyrinth. I really liked Labyrinth, but the movie Legend was like loved it as a kid, which is strange because it's kind of a bit of a scary movie for a little kid. Okay, see this kind of like a la Labyrinthy. Uh, and there's pictures on both sides. Oh, they're so pretty. Oh my god, thank you so much. You spoiled me rotten. They're so pretty. So, so, so pretty. This one's so cute. Oh, thank you so much. And I hope you enjoyed your stuff. And, like, I just want to send you another package because you spoiled me so much. And maybe I shall. I, I, I need to get my ducks in a row before I do major swaps again because I'm I've been having a hard time doing the torn tacks and the inches in the past two months. But I'm seeing a doctor. I've got some leave. I should be able to rest up and heal properly now because work hasn't let me. So thank you everybody for being patient. Um, I meant to mention this at the beginning of the video. <laughs> but thank you to all my new subscribers. I'm getting subscribers weekly and I'm touched because I haven't put out any new content. And uh, there's so many new people in, in the group and I haven't been interacting much. And yeah, I just miss everybody. And I'm there and I'm watching and uh, watching wistfully <laughs> at all the art that you guys have been doing. And so I'm hoping to jump back on the bandwagon. I've missed it. And it's been helping me. Like the art session I did a couple nights ago really helped me. I made, um, I made some cute in cheese to trade and I made a series of cuss word in cheese and it, it soothed my soul big time. So thank you very very much. I love everything to bits. There's so much cool stuff in here and I hope I hope you enjoyed what I had sent you and uh, I'm gonna cherish those unicorns. And like there's some stuff for my travel journal, there's some stuff that I can make fancy journals with. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this geek paper but I love it. And some more napkins for my growing stash. Just thank you so very much. This, this, I love it. It's so cool. So thank you so very much. And I'm going to promptly go thank you in chat because this is just so awesome. Thank you. And I hope to be starting to upload more videos in the near future. Bye, guys.